Hey there guys, welcome back to United Brothers. Uh, as you can see, I'm extremely excited. You got an amazing plane here, dude. Dude, this is awesome. <laughs> uh, this is the new uh, P-51D by Horizon Hobby. Yeah. Uh, this is actually an airplane that can run on three or four cell batteries. Mm -hmm. Uh, today we'll be doing mostly threes, just because uh, a lot of guys are going to run fours, and I kind of want to show the community what threes will look like. Yep, definitely. Mm -hmm. uh, so this airplane out of the box does have safe mode, and it has a bind and fly feature. Uh, if you have a transmitter over six channels, you can set it so you can have a flip switch. Yep. If you only have a six channel radio, uh, how we did it was you actually do not put the bind plug in, and you go ahead and initialize the plane and hit bind on your transmitter, that will be safe mode, right? Well, what you do is you uh, put the bind plug in, Yeah. plug in your battery, take it out, and then bind your uh, remote, and that sets up safe mode. Without forward. without the bind plug after that. Yep. And then if you want to fly, if you have a six channel radio and you don't need safe mode, uh, just go ahead and put the bind plug in and go ahead and bind it up normally. Yep. Um, Super easy. This thing is insanely cool. Why don't you go and show <laughs> them the coolest feature and something we've never had on the channel before? Yeah, do it. Uh, so this is the first thing we've ever had like this. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. Dude. Uh, this is gonna be cool. This is my first retrax plane and the first one ever on the channel. Mm -hmm. uh, so this airplane uh, does have gear. It also has flaps as well. Let's go show them that. Yep. There you go. And uh, I want to fly this thing. Let's do it, man. <laughs> Let's do it, man. It's gonna be sweet. Uh, and also, as you know, this to be extremely cheesy. Why don't you go flip it up this way? Mm -hmm. It's called June Night. And what month is it? <laughs> June. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. All right, we're gonna get to the flying. Let's see how this thing goes. Let's do it. Alrighty, so one thing I really want to give uh, Horizon Hobby a good shout out for, uh, a lot more companies need to do this. What's really nice is they actually provide a slide in tray, which is awesome. Uh, most companies don't do that. This makes everything so much easier uh, getting your uh, batteries in there. Throw that on. I always like uh, these straps. I don't really like these straps too much, and so we always like to put just a little bit of extra Velcro on there just as a safety measure because these do like to slide around a little bit, especially when you're doing hard turns. So watch this. This is awesome. You just open this up and if you go ahead and show them right down here there's a pair of white rails down there and all we got to do here just bring the battery right down maybe if I can do this right <laughs> there we go and you just go ahead and push her in and you're gonna hear a slight little click there it is. boom just like that that's all you gotta do that uh that definitely gets some solid points from me on them because uh a lot more people need to do that <laughs> All right, man, let's get this thing in the air. Let's do it. Ready? Yep. I'm gonna put those and... free tracks up, man. Dude. Oh, that is sexy. <laughs> Can't be in a Mustang. Uh-uh. Stop walking around. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I do that when I'm getting used to something. Now, what do you think so far? If I, it's really nice. It's relaxing. Um, right now, I'm on half throttle on a three cell. Uh -huh. Actually, it has really good speed to it. And here's full power. Oh, geez. <laughs> also, three cell, too. Yeah. Four would be ballistic. Woohoo! Alright, I think what I'd like to do. I need to stop moving around here. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I think what I'm going to try now. I'm going to go up a little higher. I'll give it a pop of the flap, see what it does. Sure. Because what we do, what we do, we did about 30% on the flaps, right? Yep. Alright, and. Nothing bad at all. Does it slow down any? Oh yeah. Do you feel like it? Okay. Oh yeah. It's pretty cool actually. Now we only did 30% because he has a DX6i and you can't actually time it to go any slower. Nope. So we didn't want it to be too aggressive. No, exactly. It flies really good. I'm really impressed with this. Looks like it tracks really, really well. I'll do a pass right over here. You ready? Yep. There you go. How cool does that look? <laughs> that is nice. Should I do some little passes if I sure. feel comfortable? Sure. Sure. Put down the flaps if you need to. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna get back over the park though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you remember we're not we don't have the whole park to us now. <laughs> <laughs> don't wanna hit any small dogs or no, not really. There's the flaps. Oh yeah, you can feel it a little bit. It's not too drastic at all though. That looks so cool. It's so quiet. I love that four-bladed prop. I know, it's actually scale looking. Yeah. I hate the ones that have two, it bugs me. It, you know, it sounds like such a little thing to complain about, but that bugs me so much. <laughs> so the three cell is actually plenty of power for it. Um, this is a really good speed for a park, I'd say. Oh yeah. Now, this is not a tiny plane, I mean, 
I definitely say medium size. I definitely have plane. I've definitely pulled planes a lot bigger. It's a 1200 but, millimeter. I'd say it's a good mid range. It's a really size. good mid range size. Yeah. Not too small. Not too big. That is awesome. Give us a nice coordinated turns of the rudder here, and yeah. it just it. Wow. It tracks really well. Did you need any trim at all? No. Awesome. Flies really really nice. We did have to adjust the uh, elevator linkage. A little bit. A little it bit. It was uh, kind of past this neutral point, wasn't it? Yeah, it was uh, way down. So. We adjusted that, and that was pretty much it. This is straight out of the box. It's flying really well. Getting cocky. <laughs> that was awesome. Now do that inverted. Okay. <laughs> now actually, let's go up a little higher. I'm gonna try inverted out. Sure. I need to try out the stall as well. Yep. See if it has that characteristics of a uh, warbird. We'll do the stall first. Sure. Okay. And we'll try it with the flaps as well. Yeah, you want me to turn this on? Or you want me to do it without the flaps first? Yeah, do it both ways. Okay, so here's all the way back, no flaps. You're going a little fast there, but. Nothing bad at all. That's good. Still no power. Wow. Very controllable. That's great for a warbird. Very wow. controllable. Um, one big thing with a lot of warbirds, they do have a tendency to do what's called tip stalling. Mm -hmm. uh, that's where one wing doesn't have quite enough speed over it, so it will actually drop in that direction because it lost lift. And uh, I did have a couple of airplanes back in the past. We did this one airplane called the Stinger. It tip stalled constantly, so I got a lot of training with that thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but now it's gone, so you don't have to worry about it. Yep, exactly. <laughs> that thing lasted too long. Let me get up higher. All right, now I'm going to try the flaps. I'm going to turn around, though. Uh, actually, I'm going to turn around and try that again, sorry. I'm going to set that up just a little bit better for you. Actually, while we're going this way, I'm going to try and vert it out. You ready? Sure. Wow. Very uneventful. <laughs> yeah, I just need a little bit of up trim and it does really well. Roll out of that. All right, let me try those flaps now. And pop those open and stall with those. That's it. Wow. You think you can land on that? I think so. Wow. <laughs> It'd be really rough though. Uh, this is, like I said, definitely a big airplane. It's got a little bit of weight to move, so that would not work. <laughs> I am seriously loving this thing, man. It's a pretty plane, for sure. Oh, it's beautiful. See some nice passes here. I'm not gonna push this battery too much longer. Try out those retracts while you fly by. Okay. I'll actually pop them out while I'm coming towards you. How about that? Yeah, yeah. Up around here. How cool does that look? That is amazing. All right, pop those retracts down. I'm a little jealous. Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> How cool is that? That is amazing. There they go back up. <laughs> so cool. I've never had a plane with those before. I won't lie, though. I'm a little concerned. I hope these hold up for a landing. You know what I mean? We'll see. All right. Should I bring her in? Yeah, let's do it. Let's put another battery in there. Hopefully. <laughs> I'll actually approach us from the other direction. Sure. Just that way you get a nice view of this thing. All right. Let's do this. I think I'll, because this is grass, I'm probably going to give it no flaps. Okay. That landing gear down. That is awesome. I'm a little jelly, got to say. Uh, let me try that one more time, sorry. Not as comfortable as I thought I'd be on that. <laughs> it's so cool to have the gear come down like that. Uh-huh. Actually, I'll just come this way. How about that? Let's sure. do that. Yeah. I guess I'll try flaps out. Just to feel a little safer about it. Yeah, slow it down. I bring her down. If she wants to come down, holy crap. It carries forever. You got tons of room. Oh, 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 I mean, oh, oh and it's on long, the wheels. It's, it's long grass. <laughs> there you go. It's on long grass. Wow. <laughs> that is amazing. I am complete. Wow. Are you shaking it, a little bit? <laughs> a little bit. That's so cool. <laughs> it's so cool to have a plane with gear. Yeah. It's just awesome. Uh, let's get another battery in this thing. I'll have you try it out. Okay. You a little nervous? A little bit. This thing flies awesome. Isn't that nice? Yeah. It's not too fast, not too slow. We are only running on 3S. So I'm not that uh, icing truck's really overbearing. He's <laughs> probably stopping for some kids, so it's going to be there for a while. We're stopping to watch. Yeah, he stopped to watch for a sec. <laughs> oh, well. We got some nice background music for you guys. Yeah, that's great. This is awesome. This Isn't is that smooth? Quiet. Yeah. A little bit of rudder. When and 3 cell is perfect for a park. Yeah. It doesn't feel very. It doesn't feel underpowered or anything. 
does need a little bit of up trim, but that's no big deal at all. Uh uh. That might have been also a two from having to adjust it a little bit. Yeah. So it's very controllable. It's very docile. Oh yeah, it's a lot more docile than I would expect a Warbird to be. Should I try a low pass? Yeah, go ahead. If you feel, feel comfortable. comfortable. <laughs> feel comfortable with me doing that? It's okay, you're paying for it. <laughs> there we go. I'll be sad. Look at that. How beautiful is that? That is awesome. Did you do any tricks with it? Not yet. Okay, let me get up a little higher and I'll do a couple. That is awesome. It's got plenty for a three cell. Oh yeah. Four cell would be crazy on this thing. Look at that. that is awesome. Now the roll isn't too bad. It's, it's not. not it's not insanely thing. quick either. No. Flip. Wow. <laughs> isn't that effortless? That is amazing. I'm actually really surprised on how easy this thing. So is go up a little higher, try and vert it out. It was pretty impressive. Sure. It needs a little bit of down. Not much though. Give it a little bit of down, there you go. Okay. Wow. That is actually really You'd hope cool. a fighter could fly like that though. Yeah. <laughs> You'd hope it would be maneuverable enough to do that. This is amazing. I like this. You a little jealous? A little bit. Good. <laughs> Good. I like when you're jealous. <laughs> oh, lost it. Okay. There you are. Like I hope you can see me, I'm pretty close. <laughs> Yeah, this camera, this camera tends to uh, just focus in the clouds. Sorry about that, guys. Yeah, we're going to need a new one pretty soon. Oh, yeah. Pretty soon, your know, brothers will be switching to 4K. Ooh. Uh-oh, there's a bird. Oh. Come to attack. You, you chopped the thing to pieces. How cool is that? That is awesome. I love that. I am loving this thing. You want to buy it now for me, don't you? <laughs> it's used. Excuse me? <laughs> Two flights on it now. Mm -hmm. I seriously love this thing. This thing's sweet. Still up there. Not infinite. Not infinite on the 3S, but a 4 would definitely do it. Oh, yeah, easily. And we only wanted to do the three cell just because I know everyone else that's reviewing these are going to have the four. And we kind of want to show you guys what a three could do. Yeah. So we'll definitely come back for another video with a four sometime. I love doing those little passes. Oh yeah, they're fun. How much longer do you think I have on this battery? Um, I think you've been up there. You've actually been up there for over five minutes now. Oh wow. It doesn't even feel like it. Oh. <laughs> uh -huh. I probably sent a solid minute that I bring it in. Okay. Are you going to want to land it? Yep. Okay. I feel very comfortable with this plane. I mean, yeah. Yeah, nice. just give it, just turn on the flaps, give it just uh, about, I did it like one tenth throttle and you'll be fine. Okay. I'll do that now, actually. Flaps down. Oh yeah, you can definitely feel it slow down. And the nice thing is though too, is it's not super drastic because of the 30%. Yeah. It just has that little bit of extra uplift for you when you're slowing down. Gear down, coming in. And the nice thing is when the gear comes down too, it brings out some drag that slows it down just a little bit more as well. Back. You are out there. There okay. we go. Oh, nice. That, that was little, that was great. A little rougher than I meant to do it. That was great. <laughs> so what do you thing, think? This thing is super easy to fly. I mean, it feels just like a high wing plane. There's no tendencies, bad tendencies to it. Um, it doesn't feel like a low wing plane at all. Like mm -mm. It mm -mm. flies excellently. Uh, there's. No solve characteristics to it. Mm -hmm. It just gently goes like this, like. I know it's just a, a nice swooping characteristics. Yeah. Um, I think what I'll do is I'll throw another battery in there. Let's get a little bit more tricks for them. I think yep. I'll try a couple of my tricks out, and then let's, uh, do, let's do some quad footage. Let's do uh, quad footage. Let's do it. There you go. Oh, no that was a steep attack angle of takeoff there. <laughs> a little bit. You're going up. That's gonna look so cool. I don't really feel the camera too bad on there. That's right on the CG, so it shouldn't matter. Can't wait just to see a little black speck fall from it. Oh god. <laughs> He's getting cocky with doing his tricks. No, I'm not. I'll do a low level pass. Those huh. tanks look so cool. Yeah, do it. How cool do those tanks look? Where are you going? <laughs> I'm coming. Okay. I'll just see how it was acting. Got a little bit more downweight on it. 
Oh, I bet. Those drop tanks look cool, and then <laughs> that camera makes it look like it's carrying a third <laughs> one. Center line tank. Or a really, really unconventional bomb. Mm hmm. That's, that looks so That cool. is awesome. Turn around here, let's do a nice coordinated turn. Yeah, you have to give it a little bit more up with this camera on there. It's not bad at all. Nice and well. Wow. <laughs> a little cocky? Real cocky. That is awesome, though. I'm definitely being a little bit haved with it because it's a little thrown off from how it was flying before. Mm hmm. Although they have extra weight on there to carry. Yeah, the three cell is like plenty for just having fun at the park. Yeah. You don't really need a four. No. But a four would be cool. Four would be really nice. I'm going to try that out sometime. Yeah. Definitely come. I definitely don't mind doing another video of this thing. Huh. Get away from the trees. All right, I'm going to try an inverter with this thing now. Sure. That camera on there. <laughs> nice and high. 20 yeah, this, mistakes, this are you? It definitely doesn't feel like, you know how the three cell is the lower battery of the two for this thing? Yeah. It doesn't feel like Cessna underpowered like the four cell did on that thing. Oh, it's, let's see here. That's not look cool. There oh, it is. Oh. There's something weird. Oh, oh. <laughs> That's me having fun. Okay. <laughs> like, I hope you're high enough to get out of that. Hold on, I'm good. I, I had it under control. I was trying to see how it kind of handles when you do that. Mm -hmm. Go, rubber stall there. I love this thing, man. Looks like you're having a blast with it. Oh, I'm in love. Put that wing off a little bit. Yeah, the stripes. Come back around. So we know it's an ally. Pass. Is so much fun to do with this? Yeah. Like, there's nothing really to worry about with it. No. Isn't it just cool to watch? It's so, like, it's just awesome. Yeah. So, I would say this is honestly be a great Warbird if you have a lot of experience with four channels. Mm-hmm. Definitely. This is a great for six, uh, six channel plane. Would you say it's a good, uh, intermediate expert kind of plane? Um, honestly, yeah. I mean... I'd say it's a little bit stronger intermediate, mm -hmm. uh, just because, like I said, you have gear, you have flap story about a little bit more stuff to, going on there. Um, but it flies. It's very, very, very forgiving. Most uh, most warbirds are like are ten, uh, prone to tip stall. Uh, they this can be kind of jittery <laughs> when they fly. This thing's just smooth. It honestly, it flies like a Cessna. It's got that really nice high wing attitude to it. But I mean, this is just a sports car. I mean, I'm just loving this. Well, this is it? It's just awesome to watch. It is a Mustang. Right? <laughs> that rudder's got plenty of authority, too. Jeez. <laughs> Everyone got to say hi to Robert and Damon then. <laughs> well, I think if they come more passive, they can bring her in. Definitely. And then we'll get the drone up, get some footage up there. For sure. Those drop tanks just like complete it. Let's hope they don't get ripped off. Quiet. <laughs> Don't scare me. Alrighty. Oh. <laughs> what was that? That was close. <laughs> I got really close to that power line. <laughs> Probably nowhere near it. Probably. It looks like it to me. That's enough. All right, wheels down. Alrighty. There they How are. How awesome is that? <laughs> Flaps down too. Cool. Let her slow down a little bit here. I need to keep a little bit more throttle with that camera there. I tried dead sticking it. Uh, you do need more throttle than uh, oh, yeah, no, none. Not work. <laughs> yes. Dude, oh. That, oh, well, it was almost, almost perfect. <laughs> almost. Almost. I'm loving this thing, man. It did really well. Uh, it's super forgiving. And it flies like a sports car, so you can still have a lot of fun with it. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't say the three cells is anything to, to be embarrassed about. It's a lot of fun. If you only got three cells laying around, you want to have a good time, that's perfect for you. Definitely. Um, we're definitely going to come back with a four cell sometime, though. Oh, I want yeah. to see that. So let's go ahead and get to the quad flying. What do you think? Let's do it.
universe inside you So won't you wake up now and see Don't hide away the things you're feeling Unlock your mind and lose the key There's the universe inside you You should never have to hide I can see the stars inside you Please just open up your eyes Yeah, no. Um, Lenny gear is good size, but uh, definitely have a very much uh, maintained grass. <laughs> definitely. For it or like the road. Course. I think the road would be perfect. This thing is oh. super stable. Yeah, definitely. Um, I'm actually really impressed. This airplane does have safe mode, which we didn't demonstrate, mm -hmm. but if that thing flies that stable without it, Metro does on safe. <laughs> yeah, definitely. It'd be super easy to fly. Oh, yeah. Um, I wouldn't recommend this to be a beginner plane, no, even with no. the safe mode on. Yeah, um, as, as we said, uh, you know, you're moving into a six-channel area. You have a few more things going on. You have flaps and yep. gear. And it's quite big as well. Yeah, it's a good size. It's a good size, <laughs> good size plane. It'll definitely yeah, intimidate a few people. Yeah. Um, and uh, this airplane is a lot more forgiving than you think it would be. It's, it doesn't yeah. have those warbird tendencies, which mm -hmm. I'm used to. Yeah. No, it's it's a great flying plane. Um, we did 30% expo on the flaps, mm -hmm. and that seemed to be perfect. It, it didn't cause the plane to jump up dramatically. Didn't slow down too much. It just had that nice slow, like the uh, slow down effect. Yeah. Yep. So. And because you are using the DXXI, um, you can't make it go down this slow. No. It just instantly. It has, it has to be quick. So, yeah. if you have a, you know, of course, all you guys are gonna have new radios. I need to get new radios. That's the next <laughs> thing on this channel. Definitely. That. Uh, if you guys have a little bit newer radios, it'd be pretty cool to set mm -hmm. this thing with, uh, you know, a little timer on the flaps. Yeah, hundred percent. Um, if I'd say if you go more than 30%, I'd probably give it a tiny bit of touch of uh, down elevator mm -hmm. on the mixing just because, you know, it's going to want to pitch up really hard. Yep. Uh, first things right off the bat, uh, it's, the stall was really impressive. Oh, yeah. Warbirds using the stall, it gets really dramatic. It this, does. This was really controllable. Yeah. You can definitely tell this is made by E-Flight. Oh, yeah. everything is just perfect. Like, it, it, 
They, were, they definitely awesome. went through a lot of testing to get oh, to yeah. this point. Definitely. Um, this model is definitely worth every penny. If I remember right, this model was uh, two hundred fifty nine ninety nine for yep. the bind and fly. Yep. And that is uh, without a battery, mm -hmm. so you definitely need your own battery. Everything else is ready to go though, except for transmitter and receiver. Definitely. Uh, I, <laughs> I gotta say, it was uh, it was cool having a retrax plane. I yeah. never I never thought I'd say that, but it was pretty fun. Yeah, first one on the channel. Yeah, it was awesome, mm -hmm. and these were great. Uh, like I said, I definitely stick to road landings, but this thing would be pretty easy. Yeah. Uh, I think this thing deserves a solid ten. I agree. It, it flew completely spectacular. Yeah. I mean, I had nothing to complain about. 100. So, alrighty, guys. Well, hey, my name's Robert. I'm Damon. Uh, thank you so much for watching this episode, of United Brothers, and uh, we'll see you guys again next time. See ya. Let's do it. Oh, oh well. <laughs>